Welcome to this YouTube channel of K-Leaders. I'm Francis Chen. In the last episode, I shared with you about registers and where to keep them. In this episode, I will share with you about significant controllers register. Question 3. Do you have a significant controllers register and appoint a designated representative? Answer to this question should be yes. Hong Kong is an international finance center. It has the obligation to comply with the international law and regulations. Due to the increasing demands and legislation for anti-money laundering, the Hong Kong government has on the 1st of March 2018 implemented a new requirement and requiring all Hong Kong companies to create and maintain a significant controller's register, SCR. The requirement is for every Hong Kong company to identify its own significant controller. Once identified, they need to serve notice to their servant controllers and ask for their confirmed particulars, including their name, address, and percentage of shareholding, etc. Once these particulars are obtained, they need to enter these particulars into registers. And if there are any subsequent change, they need to obtain the confirmed details again and update the register. The company registry confirmed that even though the company does not have servant controllers, it still has the obligation to create and maintain the register. And if the company takes time to do the investigation or obtain the particulars, they need to record the status in the register. The company also has the obligation to appoint a designated representative, and that representative will be the one who will entertain any questions from the law enforcement officer when they request the company to inspect the register. The law enforcement officer includes officers from the following government authorities, including but not limited to Company Registry, ICAC, Indian Revenue Department, and the Securities and Futures Commissions. And all these requests must be in relation to the anti-money laundering purpose. Who are the servant controllers? They can be registrable person or registrable legal entity. Registrable person is an actual person or specified entity that has certain control over the company. Registrable legal entity is a legal entity which is a company's member and has certain control over the company. Certain control means that the person or legal entity has over 25% control of the company. Control means in terms of shareholding or voting rights. The company is obliged to designate at least one person to be its representative to provide assistance relating to the register to a law enforcement officer and record the particulars of the, that representative and contact details into the register. So who can act? The representative must be a member, director or employee of the company who is an actual person resident in Hong Kong. Or if the company do not have that person in Hong Kong, they can appoint any accounting professional, legal professional, or licensed service provider like us. If the company serves notice to the identified certificate controller, but they do not respond, it will be a criminal offense. If the certificate controller provides false information, it will be also an offense. So the authority take it very serious about non-compliance in respect of the register. So the ongoing obligation of the company is to make sure that they keep the register at the address they reported to the registry. If there are any change, they need to report the registry within 15 days. They also need to make sure that the information contained in the register are up to date all the time. If there are any change, they need to obtain the particulars, the confirmed details from the servant controller concerned. And if any law enforcement officer come and want to inspect the register, the company has the obligation to make the register available and take copies of that for the officer concerned. Even though the legislation for having the register has been created since 2018, but I noticed that quite a number of clients still do not recognize the need to have that register created. So if you are aware of any of your contacts, do not know about the legislation, please tell them and make sure that they comply with the law ASAP. So thank you for watching. And we will share the other legislation in the following web episode. Bye bye. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, please give us a like and subscribe and share with your friends. Look forward to your continued support. See you next time. Bye bye.